Unless you're just allergic to the news, you've probably heard that some um, things are happening in Syria. But of course that leaves us with a lot of questions, like what will the future of the country be like? Will it just spiral into another civil war? And then of course the most important question, when will the flag emoji change? Now you'd think it's just as simple as the Unicode Consortium, the people who are responsible for every single character you see on all of your devices, issuing a statement that the Syrian flag emoji should now look like this instead. However, it's not as simple, for several reasons. Firstly, they pretty much only issue recommendations once a year, and for this year it happened in September, so we'd have to wait quite a long time for an update on that. And secondly, Unicode don't do that anyway. When it comes to emojis, the only thing that Unicode do is tell companies, hey, render the regional indicators S and Y as the flag of Syria. They don't tell anyone what that flag is supposed to look like. That is completely down to the companies who actually make those images. You know, your Googles and your Apples and your Samsungs, etc, 